Hello guys, my name is Austin, and I'm here with another review that you might have seen before, but I'm redoing it because the other one was horrible. Doing a review on the Comet Liam Morgan Signature Series. Not the airframe model, sorry guys, I don't have it, but um, it's basically the same specs. It's just a little bit lighter and a little bit torsionally better with the airframe. So I'm just going to go through the specs real quick. This board is 36.25 inches long and 9.88 inches wide at the widest point, which is where your front foot is, which is around here. About. And the uh, wheelbase is 26 on the inner, which I have it on the outer right now, but 26 on the inner right here and 27 on the outer, which I have it right now. And um, it's nine ply, it's a nine ply board, so you know it's nice and stiff. And uh, things I like about this board, it's so simple that it's so good. It's so simple that it's like, I don't know, there's something about it that just keeps it, your feet just keep locked in. Oh, sorry, by the way, the concave and rocker is 0.55 inches, by the way. Um, it just keeps you so locked in with the concave. I added this W in the back with um, with the grip tape just because I wanted to have a, like a nice feel for my back foot. But you just, even without that, it keeps you so locked in. Um, I added a foot stop too, which I um, which I recommend. I mean, it's nice. But everything is just, you keep so locked in with this. I have mine set up. Um, these are actually my downhill wheels right now, but I have some free ride wheels too. Um, I have it set up with some caliber 55 degree um, trucks. I have a 93 um, A barrel on the bottom in the back and a 90A blood orange stock caliber bushing on the, on the top uh, roadside and the same on the front. Um, Bones Reds and Cult Heroticas at the moment. Blood Orange Grip and Riptide PSD Footstop. Keeps me locked in, keeps me feeling good. And uh, I just love this board for free ride, for downhill, for... It's basically a, a great free ride board. Um, as I said before, it isn't the airframe. I'm sorry, I don't have it, but... Um, it's basically the same board except a little bit um, lighter and a little bit torsion. Let's get a close-up on the concave real quick, so hold your board up. I have the W in it, but you can still see the, the rocker and the uh, concave in there. It looks really good. Everything's staying straight. And uh, everything looks good. You know, keeps you locked in. Everything about this board, I love it. Very little flex, though. Very little flex. It's a downhill board, so it doesn't have any. Yeah, flex. so if but, you want a cruiser, um, this one probably won't be it. I actually was at a skate park and it flung out from underneath me. I don't know why I was at a skate park, <laughs> but it flung out from underneath me and chipped the back, which isn't a big deal. It's just a look thing. But still, this board is like super strong. I've thrown it around, fallen on it gone into the ditch. It survived a couple crashes, yes. Yeah. So, this board is a tank, and I love it. How many plies does it have again? It's nine plies, and... What's it made of? Huh? What's it made of? It's made of Canadian. Made. Okay. So. Skateboard. And, um, the uh, airframe model, which is still being sold, this one isn't being sold anymore, but the airframe model is 160 for the deck. This was 140, which... I think it is worth it. It's Comet. It's awesome. Go pick it up at your local skate shop or at Mirror Skate. Probably if your local skate shop has it, probably should get there. Support the community. And uh, if not, go to Mirror Skate. They're the best. Like, comment, and subscribe for more videos like this. More reviews, more overviews, more unboxings, more everything. Go check us out. We'll be having a video coming out real soon about the new uh, Comet Shred 35 that I just received this winter. We haven't been able to ride it too much because it was winter. So yeah, we'll hope to have a new video coming out for you guys soon. Thank you for watching. 
Until then, peace out. Go Longboard.